last couple of days here at Activate, I would say that my experience here has been supernatural. It would be empowering. It would be freedom. It would be expansive. It would be revival. Transformational. Empowering. Truly life-changing. I would say redeemed. This event is all about community. I would say freedom. It would be inspirational. It would be life-changing. It would be creating an avalanche. If I could describe this event in one word, it would be belonging. There's just so many pockets of moments where you're connecting with a sister in the Lord or you're praying with someone or all of a sudden you're attending a baptism on a rooftop of a pool and realizing that God is here. Coming here just expands the possibility in, in, in GPA in terms of what you can achieve, what you can help others achieve. And it also expands the vision of what God wants to do in and through you as a person, but also what God is doing in GPA across the globe. I, I'm a guest here. I, I'm not even a part of Girl Power Alliance yet. But what I've seen is a place of belonging and it's greater than a company, it's greater than a denomination or the country you come from or even the language you speak. This is a place of belonging because it's a part of the kingdom of God. And I'm just, I'm so honored and I'm so excited for what GPA is carrying forward into the earth. I am leaving here knowing that this world is so much bigger than who I am, the challenges I face, the things I'm up against. And I'm reminded that we were never meant to do life alone, ever. And so I wanna encourage you to find the place you belong and know that it's not a place of conformity or uniformity, but it is a place of unity. I am leaving this event knowing that I am used of God. I'm leaving this event knowing that I am courageous. So after leaving this event, I know that I am ever more convinced that women need to step out into their calling. After leaving this event, I am a daughter of the King. After leaving this event, I know that I am accepted and loved. After leaving this event, I know that I am bold. After leaving this event, I now know that I am the breakthrough sound of the kingdom. After leaving this event, I now know that I'm not alone, that there are other women in the world that are pursuing God's heart, His kingdom, and becoming all that He's purposed them to be, and having tools to do that in whatever realm or sphere of influence we're in is so powerful and life-changing. goodness. For those of you that were there, doesn't that just give you all the feels? <laughs> Absolutely bravo to Molly's amazing and talented husband, Johnny, for putting that great video together. Thank you to all of you who participated and collaborated for that video. It was so good. Um, and as good as that video is, those of you that weren't there, it, it's going to be really difficult for you to grasp all of the things that everybody's going to share with you tonight because um, it was, and I'm not exaggerating, the best event I've ever been to in my entire life, truly. And I've been to a lot of events, really, really great ones. And nothing is even a close second to what transpired um, in San Diego this year. And we are excited to recap all of it for you tonight. And actually, we're going to give you a couple of announcements one in particular that we did not share. So Molly, you'll have to tell me when in the in the lineup tonight you want me to share that piece. Um, but we're going to give you snippets, just snippets of some of the amazing things that happened at this event, some of the things that were launched and announced. We have a bunch of speakers 
I want to tell you, get comfortable because uh, this call is probably going to go a full 60 minutes. And we're very, very excited about introducing for those of you that maybe you're not even a part of this amazing company yet. Um, we're going to give you just a, a little piece tonight of all the things that we not only have done, are doing, plan on doing, a little bit of vision here. You can maybe taste just a smidge and smell just a little bit of what is happening here. It goes so far beyond business. It goes so far beyond personal professional development. We are working with all of our hearts to create kingdom culture here, and we are doing it because this amazing group of people is second to none. So um, yes, we're going to be here in the chat with you. We're also taking this call live on our public Facebook page or public group. So there are people in there as well. I'm going to pass it over to Molly. She did an amazing job emceeing the event. She's going to emcee this call for us tonight because it's like a mini event in and of itself. Take it away, girl. I was like, as I'm putting this together and like gathering all these ladies to like, I want everybody to share, but this would be literally like a 24 hour call if everybody shared. So we have some, we're gonna recap some amazing things that we released at the event. We have a slew of amazing testimonies. And I wanna start with one tonight uh, from Justina. Justina, I'm gonna come find you so we can spotlight you here so you can share your biggest takeaway from the event. I had the opportunity to chat with Justina a number of times, and we would love to be able to hear, you know, your biggest breakthrough or takeaway from Activate 2023. Oh my goodness. Um, my biggest takeaway is just that sense of community and sense of belonging. I know one of the ladies said it in the video. Um, I'm not a conference person. I'm like, I don't like fluff. I don't like any of that, but coming to, like Michelle said, at one of the best events, I don't go to conferences because I'm like, yeah, it's just going to be a little bit of inspiration. You're going to leave, you know, it's going to die out, right? And that, it's just, no, this has just been beautiful. So beautiful from the Kim Ken speakers, their stories that were shared, all the tears, just feeling connected to the women and knowing that um, you found your your tribe, your sisters, like people who are so genuine. I was hugged by one of the ladies um, there and she whispered just, wor just a word in my ear. And it was just confirmation to what God had been already dealing with me about. And so when I say when we're in this space, it's like prophetic and it's confirmation. And then you get to do that in person. It's just so beautiful. So I love it. I love the conference. It was amazing. It just brought to life what was happening in our community already. Thank uh, you. Justina, thank you. I'm like, it's, it's so hard to pick like one thing because so many amazing things happen. And I love that you said that confirmation. There were so many pieces of that throughout the event of she said this, she said that, oh my gosh, chills. Like, how do you, I don't even know you. And it was just so beautiful to be in that space, to see that time and time again, and to know the battles that so many went through to get there. And what was on the other side of it was so beautiful. So Justina, thank you so much for sharing that. Um, if there's anything else you'd like to share, feel free to type it in the chat. So we know our chat here is amazing and people are always reading. So up next, we'd love to be able to bring up Ferris and she's going to talk about Activate 2024 tickets. And I saw Ruby already post this and she goes, how many people have already got their tickets for Activate 2024? And quite a few of you. So Ferris, let them know what they got coming for them Woo. for tonight. Woo. I'm so excited. I'm literally sitting, I feel more nervous on this Zoom than I did on stage and just watching the video and seeing all of you guys in person, I'm just super amped up in my chair. Like I'm sweating. I'm like, oh my gosh, like I wish I could just go back. Um, but as far as activate 2024, San Diego, California at the Hard Rock Hotel, ladies, this will be from October 10th through the 12th. It's going to be the same type of vibe throughout the weekend. We go Friday, uh, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. So I want everybody on here and I'm so excited because we have over a hundred women and I see some people are having like breakout parties. We have multiple people tuning in. I want you guys all there. It is meant for you guys. We need you there. We have sold over 50 tickets already, 50 tickets. And I know that I had announced it. So a couple things we have extended for the next 24 hours from 5 p.m. Pacific, 5 p.m. Pacific tomorrow, tickets are 
just like at the conference. I'm going to slap it right in here. We've already changed it over. You can buy now. Go ahead. If you guys break the internet again, please show us some grace because I didn't have a chance to say it at the event. Everyone's like, it's not working. It's not working. We literally broke the internet in the hotel. So that's very, very, very exciting. So second thing, 199 for the next 24 hours. Tell your teams, okay? 199 for 24 hours. After the 24 hours, till the end of the month, the 31st of October, we're gonna do another special on the ticket. It's gonna be 229, okay? That'll be the second lowest you will see it. After the 31st, those price of those tickets are gonna go up to the regular 279. So you have until the 31st to get special pricing, but why wait? You have 24 hours. So that was my huge announcement. I'm so excited. Thank you so much, Molly. And thank you all you ladies for being here. I love it. Why wait? Buy now. Get in. But seriously, because it was so good. <laughs> and I think I feel like majority of the tickets, obviously, from people at the event got them. But I've seen so many women. One that I saw that came in from one of our ambassadors in New Zealand. Leanne, I'm so excited to meet you. Just women all around the world that are like, I, I have to be there and I need to get this right now. We're buying the ticket. We're doing the thing. So I absolutely love that. So we are actually type in the chat how many team members you want to bring with you next year. Because we talk about this at the event and everybody was like, oh, I want to bring 10, I bring this and that. So we want to make this so big that we have to get a bigger room, ladies. And this hotel can hold a lot of people. So I'm sure this chat is about to go. Yep, it's gone. 20, yes, 10, 10, 15, 20. 10. Okay, yeah, y'all are just blowing up that chat. Love it. Okay, I cannot wait to bring up another testimony. Now, I know Justina talked about a little bit, and we're not going to go too far into it on this call. This could be a whole nother call. But we certified our Kim 10 speakers, over 20 of them. And so this lady I'm about to bring up, she had an incredible Kim 10. She was actually featured inside of Activate to share her story. And so I want her to come up. I'm going to bring you up to Stina to be able to share. I know it's going to be hard. Just one, your, your biggest breakthrough takeaway, whatever that is, share it with us from Activate. You got it, girl. Hey, guys. All right. So I have two, but I'm going to keep it 30 seconds each. So my first breakthrough was that I actually went face to face with my grandmother and I told her, I said, there's been a generational curse on our family with poverty and I want to be the generational curse breaker. And I went to her and I literally told her to the point where she got uncomfortable and was like, okay, I'm going to go now. But I declared it for myself, proclaimed it for my family. And I am so clear on the vision and I am ready to link arms with women to make that happen for myself and for them. The second takeaway was that I've been in church my whole life for over 30 years. I left my church in 2019. I never thought that I would feel the community again. I never thought that I would have a place again. I never thought that I would feel the Holy Spirit and God the way that I did in that old church again. This community is the again. That's my takeaway. Oh my gosh, so good. When I talked to Destina the other day and she told me what she said to her grandmother and her grandmother's reaction, I said, you have to share that. I'm breaking the generational curse right now. And you know what? I'm getting the, as you would call it, Destina, the goosies, getting the goosies right now. Like, yes, I'm, it, I feel that so many women on this call, we get to step into that and be the possibility and show something different. So I love that to your grandmother. And she was probably like, what is going on right now? I just absolutely love that you have that boldness. And I know that is freedom for somebody to hear that. So thank you so much for sharing that and just being bold and um, for sharing your breakthrough with us. We really appreciate that. So if you're at the event, if you're watching online, the next thing that we want to share with you is we had our founding ambassador promotion going on. You hit the rank of influencer one. It was by the end of September, you could become a founding ambassador. Well, Michelle and all of her generosity and here on the team, we want more of you on the stage. We want to pack out that stage for the next event for founding ambassadors for you forever to have the title. And we extended that. And I'm going to go ahead and bring up Lisa. Lisa V, got to scroll down. We've got so many people in here. I love it. All right, let me see if I can snag you, Lisa. All right, you got to scroll. 
Sorry, y'all. She was just there. She on here? Lisa? Um, yeah, here. Lisa, here you are. <laughs> all right, take it away, my friend. First of all, how much time do I have? <laughs> a couple minutes, go. <laughs> well, I just wanted to say, first of all, in the chat, let me know who's going for founding ambassador put. I am. I just wanted to share with you, Molly asked me to share with you a little bit about why, what, what is so great about going for founding ambassador. First of all, there's a few things that happens when you become a founding ambassador. It increases your credibility, your visibility, and your profitability. So you are at a place where when you set a target to go for founding ambassador, you not only inspire your, your team, but you also now bring yourself to a whole new level of leadership. You become that much more able to stand in that place. And people say, well, if she can do it, I can do it. So you inspire your team to go for it. And you have the fulfillment of seeing yourself reach a goal. You went for it. And then the other thing is the financial. Now you open up a whole new level of finances. You get another bonus when you hit that level, but you also now open up a whole new level for your team because you've helped them to reach new ranks. And so you have that fulfillment of seeing them come up to new ranks and seeing them gain more income in their business. And the last thing is the freedom. Now you begin to see the power of leverage when you become a founding ambassador. So when you hit that influencer one and you do it sooner, now you become part of the foundation of Girl Power Alliance. Forever and ever and ever, you will be known as one of the OGs here forever when it started. When the movement is in the millions across the globe, you can say, I was there. I, was, I am a founding ambassador. So who ex who's who's excited about that? Who's excited about up leveling your visibility, your credibility, and your profitability? Lisa, I love that you have like the it, phenomenal. And Ferris, if you could do me a favor and bring Michelle Tufford up here as well, because Lisa, Michelle Tufford, um, Natalie, she's not able to be on this call because she's out there living her best life, y'all. It's like two a.m. in Europe, traveling with her husband enjoying she's like I have to get a little bit of sleep because I got to be up in five hours otherwise she would be here but because what she's been able to create with Girl Power Alliance she's traveling with her husband don't we all want to do that so Lisa Michelle I'm doing something little impromptu here with both of you first of all Lisa Michelle and Natalie are also our field advisory board they're founding ambassadors here tell a little bit what it was like you know jumping on stage and just you know being able to, to grab that title because you three have pioneered so much here with us and we'd love to hear a little bit about that Hey, what's up guys? Wow. I mean, being up on that stage and looking out on the, in the faces of all of these ladies, it just made me realize, I love what Justina said about this being like just confirmation of what has been going on here for the last year. Like, cause I was wondering that I'm like, well, I mean, I knew it was going to be powerful. Like I knew coming to this event, I knew it was going to be powerful, but I had no idea that it was going to be this powerful. But I think the reason why is because we got to see the experience of all these women's growth happen over the course of the year. And then it like all kind of coming to this one place um, in person. So standing on stage and looking out in the faces of these ladies, getting to see firsthand the growth of when they start to like where they are today and realizing like, wow, like I get to be a part of that growth journey with them. So as a founding ambassador, being able to see like, wow, look what we're pioneering. Like, what, look what we get to be a part of in impacting these women's lives in such a, a, a deep way. Like what we're doing here really does matter. And it's so much bigger than, it's so much bigger than business here. <laughs> so much bigger. And just makes me that much more excited for, for what we're going to be doing now with all of you now who have said, I want to be a founding ambassador who are going to get out there and you're going to share. You're going to be loud about this because women need to be in this room. Like I said on stage that I believe that we are going to have a thousand women uh, activate next year. Like I still stand on that because I know that every single woman who was in that room was like, there was a fire lit inside of you. Let me know in the comments if that was you, like if something lit in you and you're like, okay, I love Girl Power Alliance before, but like something happened at that event that you are not the same person. You're about ready to just go and blow it up. Like, I believe that we're going to see enrollments and rank advancements happening so fast here. Um, so yeah, so I can't wait to see all of you who, who jump on board and become founding ambassadors 
with us. Help us pioneer. Yes. Help us pioneer. You know, jumping off of that, a pioneer, sometimes pioneers, it takes a little bit of time to break through some of those barriers, whether it be mindset, because remember, we're doing a new thing here. Michelle Schaefer always tells us that, right? We're doing a new thing here. God said, we are changing the narrative of network marketing. So because of that, sometimes there's these little things we come up against. And so as pioneers, that's par for the course. But once you break through, once you go through, and as a founding ambassador, that's what I, I find is the belief system comes to a whole nother level. And your team then begin to believe, okay, wow, they're, they're really going somewhere. This is, this is not just a little, you know, thing that's here and gone tomorrow. We're in this for the long haul. So I, I, it's such an honor, but it, it more than anything it excites me because I know if I can do it, I'm a busy lady. If I can do it, I know everyone on this call can do it. So yeah, let's, let's do it a thousand women next year, but more than that by December 31st, how many, how many, how many founding ambassadors do we want Molly by December uh, 31st? Goodness gracious. I mean, y'all <laughs> let me know in the chat. I, I got, I'm the vision. I love casting vision. So, I mean, you ask me, I'd say a hundred, but I, I mean, I always go hard in the paint. Let's, let's go, <laughs> let's go big number, but there's so many women coming to me. I can't tell you how many calls I've been on with ambassadors. How do I get there? How do I get there? I want to dive into my numbers. Let's do this thing. And the laser focus of just go until December 31st, 1159, 59, like keep going. Yeah. Maybe take a break for Thanksgiving for Christmas, but like, keep it rolling because that is going to be incredible momentum going into the next year and then getting the title. So thank you so much, Michelle. Thank you so much, Lisa, for sharing. Michelle, I'm actually going to keep you up here because we have you. Uh, let me bring you back and switch. Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Play. Perfect. Here we go. Um, so I want to be able to have Michelle up here because we released some amazing new tools and she's going to talk about a really, really exciting one that is helping a lot of women as of right now get to founding ambassador because it's casting the vision, showing the mission and a lot of goodness of what we have here at GPA. So Michelle Tuppert, I'd love for you to share our favorite new tool that we just released. For sure. So I'm sure a lot of you ladies maybe saw it, but we released a done for you sales funnel. Uh, man, if you know what a sales funnel is, you know that it is used by businesses to really create more automation in your business, allow you to send someone a link, right. And have it actually do the selling process, a lot of it for you, right. It's not, we're not taking away the personal relationship piece because that is going to be your most important, but this is going to allow you to really focus on that personal relationship and allow the link that you share with them to do all of the, the education that they need in order to learn more about this organization, how it all works, how the compensation works. They're going to see testimonials from all these amazing women. Um, the videos that are in this sales funnel are top notch. Like they are professional and I'm so excited about having this tool because it, again, it allows me to focus on what I love, which is building relationships. And then I can share that resource. And it just makes this process of bringing people on board here so much easier. Uh, and what happens too, you guys, you, you guys need to go through, if you're an ambassador here already, like like you need to sign up and go through the sales funnel yourself. So you know exactly what's in there and you know the process because you need to understand what you're sending to them. But when you sign up for it, you'll see, you'll put your name, your email and your phone number in. So the amazing thing about that is when someone actually clicks through and fills that information out, you get an email with their name, their phone number and their email. So now you've just made that connection. You can reach out to them. Now, the other thing that happens is that it triggers an email marketing system that's done for you. Okay. So if email marketing is like not in your wheelhouse. You're not tech savvy. That's not the things that you're, you're into. Don't worry because here it is literally done for you. It triggers that email marketing. And now they're getting an email from girl power Alliance every single day for seven days, just telling them a little bit more. It's giving them those multiple touch points that you need to grow and build a business here. Okay. When we look at sales and someone actually deciding to, to get started, it takes anywhere from, I think it's like seven to 20 
touch points in order for that to happen. So our funnel allows you to actually hit all of those touch points from one link and you just get to build relationships here. So the other thing that it does is it's saving you a lot of money because you could go out and build a funnel yourself, but you're going to be spending just for hosting that funnel. If you were to use ClickFunnels or Kajabi, it's going to be anywhere from $150 to $200 a month just for hosting a funnel that may, you would have to build yourself. Here, you do not have to pay that monthly hosting. So when you look at the monthly membership here, our VIP membership, $150 a month now includes a funnel. Like when you look at the, the cost savings for, for people in business, like, man, it's, it's game over. <laughs> uh, for the value that we have here, was, it was already amazing, but we've just taken it to a whole nother level with this. So very excited. Uh, Michelle, you're amazing. I love that. There's so much value. So like she said, if you haven't gone through it, go through it. So for those that are wondering where it's at, it's under my links inside of your membership back office for all VIPs. Click on it, go through it. You're absolutely going to love it. It's just so full and rich. And like Michelle said, so many touch points. And it's beautiful, by the way, because everything first and everything the team creates is just gorgeous because we want to aesthetically look at it and make it be like, ah, oh, this is amazing. And you are going to get that experience. So is everybody else. And so I personally love sharing the funnel uh, whenever I wanted to, you know, cast the vision for somebody and then the sneak peek. So you get literally like, here you go, everything that you can need. And you could watch it within 24 hours. Love to follow up with you tomorrow. Like you're going to get everything that you need. Love that. All right. So we have a couple amazing testimonies coming up. So Ferris, if you could help me spotlight Candace Daniel. I know Candace had, um, obviously all of y'all had such an incredible event, but she definitely was somebody that came up to me multiple times and just breakthrough after breakthrough. So I know you have many, Candace. Give us your top breakthrough that you had at Activate. So last week at Activate was nothing short of life changing, you guys. It began opening night ceremony night with praise and worship. And that reignited a flame in me that I thought had long burned out. Um, it was consumed, I was consumed by doubts and fears. I'd allowed myself to believe um, these things as truth. And this event activated me, it propelled me out of my comfort zone and into the purpose and plans that I have always known that God's had for me. The most powerful part was closing night at the gala when my mentor, Michelle Tufford, <laughs> received an award shaped like an eagle for graduating the most women from GPA's Radiant Leadership Academy, which I'm in right now, my second round. And that moment, I saw myself receiving that exact same award because I too have been told that I'm an eagle. And she's the wind that's been beneath my wings from the second that I met her. So the powerful testimonies and the stories um, from the others that I heard, they encouraged me to pick up my own crown, to spread my wings and to soar into the unknown by locking arms with these incredible women in this community. And as I left for the airport, I heard these resounding words in my head and it was get comfortable with being really uncomfortable. And it's so true that growth and change lie beyond our comfort zone. So I urge all of you out there to step out of your comfort zone, partner with this movement in the marketplace ministry, and plan to be at Activate next year. Um, it's where you're going to reignite your purpose, and you're going to join a community of eagles that are going to propel you into new heights in your personal and your professional life. So be there, everyone. Be there. Oh my gosh, Candace. So good. I love that. And I saw somebody put in the chat. It's the details. Isn't it though? You're like, how did she give that thing and say that? Like what? Because we serve a big God and he's all about the details. One of the things that the Lord's really been revealing to me is that context. You can see these one-liners, you can see the award, you can see the flash, you can see all this what you've experienced at Activate, or maybe you weren't there, but you're listening on this call and you're getting breakthrough by listening on this call, share the context with people. There's so much detail that you literally could have content on social media for the next like three years <laughs> when it comes to Activate, but context is king. Give them that meat. Tell them the story behind the story, right? Because they can only see so much, but you have something so much deeper. 
And I learned that by talking with so many with you at Activate. I was like, wow, the context I'm receiving for so many of you gets me and our team, the corporate team just ingrained in like why you're truly here and just all the just Anyways, all the things, all the things, all the grains of the sand, all of it. So thank you so much, Candice. That was absolutely beautiful. So coming up next, we're going to bring back up the famous Ferris C, and she is going to talk about our GPA planner, which is absolutely incredible that we just released, that she's going to give you all the, the juice and the details. So Ferris, bring it home. Who's got the planner? Oh my goodness. When we announced the planner, and this has been years in the making. You guys, it really has. I know that after we talked about it, some of you kind of seen it inside the merch store. I'm sure some of you seen it online and you're kind of like, well, what is it? Is it just like a regular planner? Sometimes I write, sometimes I'm on my phone. And I would say half of you in that room raised your hand on the halvesies. So my halvesies, I'm sure a lot of you got them. I know you guys got them afterwards. They're still available in our shop. We have updated our shop, so we still have some of these available. But man, I was going through it before this call, and I was like, well, let me just kind of like go through it again and really kind of dig into it. You know, there's little pro tips in here. There's strategic lines. And I think one of my favorite things, and, you know, I will kind of show you, this is, this is good for anybody. My daughter obviously has taken control of this one here, but she literally has goals for October is to do all of her schoolwork. I mean, it can be literally as simple as that, you know, set these simple goals, but that are tangible and achievable, especially if you're running and you have some devotionals to keep you, you know, accountable and to keep you in with God as you're going through and sharing it. I mean, I love the business tracker. It really tells you how many reach outs, follow ups, three way calls, presentations. And I hope most of you are kind of blowing this out the water. And, you know, at the event, um, Miss Lynn had said that this is the best planner she has ever felt and ever seen. So I definitely want to, you know, encourage you guys if you don't have one yet definitely get one. It is good for a year. It is amazing. It's thick. You can take it anywhere with you. And I know I talked about it. We have these little cool QR codes here. Now it's still accessible with your phone as well. So definitely get it. I love it. I think it's amazing. It's so needed for business building, but that's what I got for you guys here on the planner. Love that. Lynn, I'm bringing you up and, uh, I, I know I, I sent you an email. I never heard from you, but I'm going to bring you up here for just a second. If you don't mind me putting you on the spot, because when you talked about the planner at Activate, I was trying to get a hold of you because I'm like, that was so good. We have to share. So do you mind unmuting yourself and sharing what you shared when it comes to the planner? Because you just got up and you shared a word, which you always do. You'll come to know Lynn. She has a word and it's always good. So we want to hear the word about the Lynn planner. Uh, we want to hear the word about the planner, Lynn. <laughs> okay. Um I look through it and one of the, the I am just about ready for bed. <laughs> anyway, okay, you guys. Um, this is this is the best part. The first page here, but I, I'll tell you what's the best. This. Can you see this? That's okay. That's that is the best because it helps you keep yourself in order for the day and and then it, and I'm a person you write five things you have to do today and if you don't get them done you move them over to tomorrow that's the way I work and also it keeps your life straight look so you don't forget when we're supposed to come on a call <laughs> you can take everything from the calendar and put it in here put it beside your desk you can put birthdays in you don't forget you put in little notes that I have to text somebody or I have to phone somebody so there's so much room in this and it's so well laid out and I've used planners for a long time. I mean, with six kids and soccer practices, the ballet and going, driving them back and forth to school, you had to have it meticulously written down. Otherwise, you might forget somebody in ballet class. It sounds like that might have been a personal experience. Am I wrong? You're like, whoops, my bad. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. Lynn, thank you so much for being, for sharing and for allowing me just to bring you up. I didn't even ask. 
but thank you so much. We appreciate you. We're like, we got to find Lynn and Michelle texted me. I'm like, I'm on it. I'm finding her. We're bringing her up. So thank you, Lynn. We love you. Thanks for being a good sport. Uh, but yeah, she's right. I mean, you have room to make sure you don't miss a thing because we have busy lives and this planner, like Ferris said, literally planned it out for everything, everything. And so you have space for all the things and more. So you're absolutely going to love it. So we want to bring up, uh, Ferris, if you can help me bring up Lemon. At the event, we had a booking blitz for our Be The Change events. If you don't know what that is, basically the Be The Change event, first of all, we gotta be the change that people need to see. And we encourage women to book on the spot, whether it was a virtual or in-person Be The Change event. If you're wondering how to put one of those on, we have a full breakdown of what that looks like in your ambassador back office. And I see Lemon in the front row and you get a ticket for everyone you book. And she has like a ticket that could almost go around the globe. I'm like, okay, so somebody's booking a ton. But at the, at the event, at the event, over a hundred events were booked and way more happened after that, just across everybody. So probably hundreds, safe to say, I just stopped counting. So I'm just saying over a hundred, but I want Lemon to kind of talk about, you know, when you were like, okay, I'm going to book these things, what that's done for your team. Give us a little of the inside there. Yeah. Um, I thought Karen was going to smack me when she came over and saw the amount that were on my list, but I just love them. I love hosting these events. I love seeing the transformation in the women coming. I've had non-Christians come to my event and feel like they have a home here. And so when you were like, we're doing a booking blitz, I'm like, yeah, we're going to do a booking blitz because I know the impact that it has. And I've seen my team book so many. I've been getting, um, Molly, I know you're getting the DMs too from them just being like, we're booking this event. We're booking this event. I think I have events booked out through 2025 right now, which is really exciting. So please don't change the format on me because I'm I'm set for the next 18 months plus. So I, I just know how transformational they are. And I know the impact it has. Um, I've had people on my team host events like that and enroll five people in an hour. So they're really powerful for just your growth and the growth of the people you want to support. So I had to do them. I love that. And since I have you here, something else came to mind. You know, I know there's quite a few leaders that had quite a few team members that were there. And I remember having, you know, um, tried to get with many teams as I could while I was there. There's only one of me and many of you talk about what it was like to be able to see all those team members that were there from last year to this year and just seeing that grow. Yeah, it was really special. So I actually had a team chat for my virtual ladies and my ladies in person. So we could get together and coordinate dinner and all of those things. And the chat was just blowing up with takeaways and how on fire everybody was. And it was just, it was honestly a really special thing. There was after the baptisms Friday night, we were all supposed to go to dinner, but blow that didn't happen for probably anybody on the team. And so it was great. Like we just sat in our sweatpants and sweatshirts and ordered DoorDash and like hung out in my room and just had a chance to bond. And I don't know if Jen's here, but Jen Rogers, but you know, we shared a room together and she was like, it was really cool to see your leadership and the way that you've transformed as leader. Cause I've known Jen for years. Um, yep. There's Jen. And so it was really cool for that conversation too, for her to say, I've seen the transformation and just be able to bond with my team in that way. Um, I think it shifted the dynamic on my team a little bit in the best way possible. So it was really exciting. I love that. Thank you, Lemon. I appreciate you. Events booked through 2025. Dang, girl, go after it. I love that. You all should. I mean, now is the time. Whatever you do right now in the next 30 days, I mean, you're going to springboard into 2024. And that's exactly what this event has done for people. It's like that slingshot and it's springing everybody forward. And the fire is felt all around. And so we all love it. So thank you, Lemon, for sharing that. Um, next, I am going to pull up uh, Michelle Tasco. So I brought Michelle Tasco up to be able to share um, just one of her biggest breakthroughs and takeaways from Activate. And Michelle, there was something about every time, I mean, a lot of people caught my eye, but I always was looking in this corner of the room where you're sitting next to uh, Megan Felix, and you guys were just so intently just looking. And so I'm like, I wonder what they're thinking. I wonder what they're experiencing Obviously, a lot to experience, but I would love to know just what the Lord is either stirring in your heart or even just from the leverage you can build here. Anything that really stood out to you that you can share with us that you really walked away from Activate and said, wow, like I'm excited to do this thing. Yeah, absolutely. You know what I really loved is the caliber of the women all around that I, I, I really just soaked it in like a sponge. And 
it's not often that you get into a room where you have people, women coming together, linking arms and wanting the best for each other, wanting more for each other and for themselves, and also lifting each other up and holding them high. And oftentimes I think that uh, for many of us, we hide and this is the time in the season to not hide. It's the time in the season to shine really, and to be seen and to think, well, if they can do it, I can do it. If I've had this dream of wanting to take my family to Hawaii or be able to buy a house or be able to um, be home with my kids, that it is so possible for each and every one here because this business is a great equalizer. And uh, it's the same thing. Like we all have 24 hours in a day and some people get further faster when they leverage their 24 hours and others don't. And so I think that with this opportunity, what I'm realizing too, that it's not just about how do I get ahead with my walk with the Lord, but how many people can I bring with me? How many people do I want to do life together with? Because these are the ones that uh, I would say, it's so important to have people have your back and also to have soul sisters. And, you know, we're birthed into a family, but we can also expand our family. And so when I was looking around the room, I'm like, oh, I love that person's story. And I love that person's smile. And I love that person's um, potential because I could see it. I could see um, them starting to get it. And I could see them realizing, oh my gosh, I can transform myself. I can transform my life. I can transform uh, the financial legacy that I can build for generations to come. And um, just that, that kind of seed that gets planted in all of us, there's, there's something about all of us have an ember inside of us. And I think with Girl Power Alliance, it gets lit on fire. And if you want to stay close to the campfire, and we can ignite the whole entire world. Oh, Michelle, that's so powerful. And for those that don't know Michelle's background, I mean, she is a financial coach, and so much more. But to be able to, you know, just see just how you can, it goes beyond you. You've always had that heart. And that's something I've always loved about you. You just have this genuine heart. I want to serve. I want to help people and really bring them freedom. And I love that you saw that in the room. And I agree. The more stories you listen to, you're just like, wow. Like you're either like, I can see myself in that. I can empathize with that. It just it brings you closer just by them sharing their vulnerability and their words. So thank you so much for coming up and sharing. That was such a blessing. And for every single one of you that has come up and shared, and I know there's so many more that haven't. So if you have some kind of a breakthrough testimony, anything from Activate, please put it in the chat because we all are reading that. And you see if the chat goes crazy because so many women are just so on fire here. So a couple of things that I also wanted to share when it comes to what we released at Activate. So you can see me wearing this. This isn't in the merch yet, but we have a lot of merch that we released and we did it on purpose. One, because we love merch. Two, because we launched our merch affiliate program. So this is now the seventh way that you can get paid inside Girl Power Alliance. It's separate from our compensation plan, but you can come here, enroll as a free affiliate for being a merch affiliate here, and then you can uh, get 10% from your own merch, 10% off, and then earn two levels deep when it comes to helping other people grow your free affiliate team, if you want to call it that. So just another amazing way, because I don't know about you, Instagram quite literally stalks me and haunts me of all the cutest merch everywhere, like constant clothes. And I'm like, obviously, I know if I'm going to click on that, it's going to keep popping up. So why not us? Why not have clothes? And on the back, it says, it says, I am on the front. And then as a picture of a lion, it says daughter of the king. And I love sporting this out because then people are like, huh, you know, and it's a great conversation starter. Ferris has one that says God sized dreams. You know, there's so many amazing phrases and just it, it, it will hopefully start a conversation with somebody else. But hey, more amazing marketing for GPA, get people to be like, I love that. It's cute. I want to wait, what's going on here? So we launched that program, which is super amazing. You can go inside of your back office, click on GPA merch and get signed up for free. Again, it's free. And we launched our social influencer program. So for those people who have a lot of influence, they have a big, large network and they want another stream of income, they can come in as an affiliate for free and be able to earn instant pay and passive pay through the member bonus pool if they want to just help women get started here. They're not actively building the business, but they want that income stream that can help women get started. But 
We all know that those women are going to be more than taken care of here because we're one big family here at GPA. So you can also find that social influencer link in your back office. And then last but certainly not least, outside of the planner, we also released a gratitude journal. Now, this is something that's super special. It'd be perfect to get as a gift, and it's inside of our merch shop. Imagine you writing for 30 days something that you're grateful for. And this could be honestly a good birthday present, Christmas present, like writing out what you're grateful for. I did the gratitude journal wasn't done yet, but I actually gave that to my husband as a part of his birthday gift this year. And he just was like, what? Like conjuring up all of the memories and really digging down deep. And then to be honest, you know, sometimes it's like, maybe I need to go back there and look at it because we're in a fight or something. No, I'm just kidding. But like, you want to be able to like bring those memories back. And so the gratitude journal is such a great way to have something physical to write down, to give to somebody as a gift. It's such a beautiful thing. So that is something that's available inside of our store, the GPA merch. So you can be able to check that out. So a couple amazing uh, other additional releases and just more ways to have more impact, be the change. Imagine giving that gratitude journal to somebody. Maybe it's like a, 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 an uncle or an aunt or something or your parents. Like that, how amazing would that be? And they're going to be like, wow, you remember this? You thought of me? So I just, I just love how we just continue to increase and grow. How can we reach more people and touch people, whether it's the message on our shirt or a message in a journal, like that is something that I just, I just love that we get to do that all the time. So we have one more testimony before we wrap up and Michelle's going to come back and she has another announcement for you. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and bring up Lene. Lene, we're going to find you and bring you up here. Oh team is on it. So Lene has a cool story. Lene, I'm actually not going to spoil it. I'm going to let you share the story because I've never met you before up until this event. So tell us all the goods. I'm just going to all the goods. Go. How do I condense all the goods? I so, know, so I feel like it activate. It was like my personal mission statement or my personal mission. It's it collided with God's anointing on the kingdom in this season. Like that's the best way to describe it for me. So a couple of years ago, I wrote a personal mission statement for myself, and it really summarizes who I like, what I love. I love to inspire to go higher, but my, my statement says that I want to consistently be available as a conduit for the Lord to restore faith, hope, and freedom to his children. And I've been sitting on that. And GPA gives me that avenue to be able to be that conduit to really inspire women to go higher and reach for their call. Um, I had been called to write a book back in February. I had introduced to GPA a year ago, but was like, I don't feel like it's the right time. I'm supposed to write this book. I have no idea what I'm doing. I wrote the book. I published it in February and I sat and the Lord said, just wait. And then I felt like he nudged me to now pick up GPA and explore it. So I flew from Ohio. I had no idea what I was going to. I don't really like conferences. I'm like, Justine, I was like, it's, it's just fluff, blah, blah, blah. But here's what I saw. I believe I saw Ephesians 4, 16 come into life. So if you read Ephesians 4, you, it talks about the body of Christ being built. It's like the Lord is building a house, a whole body. And it says it's fitly joined together and compacted by that, which every joint supplies folks. That's us. We're the joints. And as we come into that anointing, that call, as we reach for Jesus and our destiny unfolds before us, we're being built into a body and a house for the Lord to put his head on. This is so much bigger than the business. I love the business model. I love money. I love all the freedom. But man, there was an anointing on this. And I finally feel like I'm a square peg in a square hole. And it's time for me to step in and go higher and inspire others to do the same. A square peg in a square hole. Come on. I mean, does it get much better than that? Like you finally fit. And mm -hmm. I've heard so many women say, this is home. I yeah. finally found my home. Lynette, it's so powerful. Again, just to reiterate, just to reiterate, this is... So powerful because you flew from Ohio, you came in, you didn't know anything. And then at the end, you're like, I'm not even signed up yet, but I'm in, I'm in, I'm in. And then she's like, just all the things. And so I just absolutely love and adore that. Thank you so much for your honesty and generosity of just sharing 
your true heart and like what it is that came in from everybody that shared. And I have actually one more share. I did not forget. I did not forget. Nicole, where are you? Oh, it's okay. No worries. <laughs> I, did not forget. I was like, I'm looking at my list. I'm like, there's somebody, Nicole. Yes. Okay. So, <laughs> Nicole, there's so many women we could bring up here. And Nicole, somebody that I wanted to bring up because Nicole was one of our incredible speakers talking about how you can leverage the 24 hour sneak peek. And then just Nicole, you did such an incredible job on stage. So I know, again, it's going to be hard just to pick one thing <laughs> when it comes to, you know, your experience and what you had at Activate, but please share your heart with us tonight. Okay. Well, I'm going to share two things again, but really fast. Um, the RSA certification, those, man, Dustina and the others, they were fire. And I just see the value now of going through that certification. I talked to Shay Vines and she was one of the judges um, be, be able to see or hear what happened from the one day to the next of getting that feedback and just really, you know, going to the next level with those speeches. So I am so excited. I wanted to hear all of them. I'm like, how do we, how do we hear all the ones that I didn't get to hear? So that was amazing. Um, Lemon touched on getting together with the team. I had 11 people there. I had only met one of them in person. I was like, amazing. Like, I, you know, Kristen's on here. We've talked every day for a year and we've never met. It was so crazy. And so that was just amazing just to be, just to get to know each other, even though you can be on Zoom and calls and whatever, there's just something obviously so much better about being in person. And just on that note, I have one of my team members, I'm not going to say who it was, but um, I got to know her in a whole different level. And I realized that she's been playing small. You know, this, I thought she was like, oh, this sweet little, you know, cute little woman. I'm like, oh no, you're fiery. <laughs> like you have a lot more that you can, you know, that you can do. And so it's kind of like Intel. <laughs> so now um, she said, I came with the hobby and leaving with the business. And so just this fire was uh, lit under, under all of us. So that's it. Oh my gosh. That was so good. Like, I love the fact that you said, you know, you got to that, that deeper connection, right? Which us as women, we, we crave. That's why we love community. And then you get that in-person piece. And I had a lot of People be like, how do we bring Activate to other, you know, my city and all these other events? I'm like, it may not be that big. Get that in-person connection to drill down deep. You would have never maybe experienced that over Zoom. And you're like, oh no, it's time to go, sis. Like, let's get in there. Let's make it happen. I love that. And you're so intentional, Nicole. Like you're very intentional with everything that you do and you see things and some things that people miss. And you're like, I see something there. I'm going to go after that. And I love that about you. So thank you so much for sharing. And for yeah, everybody that shared on this call, again, so many people that could share on this call. And if you haven't shared, like get on a Facebook live, share it in a post, share it somewhere. Uh, this is going live inside of our Facebook group. So go share it in there too. So the women can hear your testimony. So Michelle Schaefer, close us out. Give us the, the, the last bit of goods, the last final announcement. And again, thank you to everybody for sharing. Gosh, that call. Holy moly. It, that went by fast, didn't it? Did you, that go by fast for you guys an hour? I felt like there was so much more we could have said. So many people that we could have had on, on the call. Molly, you crushed it as always. Everybody that spoke. I know you had so much more to share. You did so good sharing short because how do you take all the things that happened and wrap them up in 30 seconds? It's almost impossible. I have two things, one that nobody's heard before and one that you all heard. I just want to reiterate. We have our We Want You Back um, promotion going on right now. If you have anybody that's ever been signed up here with us, they can come back now. They don't have to, all they have to do is reignite their existing membership. Um, they don't have to pay any additional fees and they can keep their original spot. For some people, this means there's actually money in the bank because the team below them has grown. So do not hesitate to reach back out to people that were here and for one reason or, an, re reason or another, they had to leave. Like, don't, don't shut them out. Statistically, they say that people's lives change dramatically every six months. So reach out to all of those people that were members and or ambassadors and say, hey, we've got a lot of new things that we've added to our uh, toolbox here. And I just came back from this amazing event. And uh, so reach out to them. That's going on um, till the end of the month. We're going to allow that till the end of the month. And the last thing here that I was supposed to announce at the event and TBH, I just forgot. There is so much going on. I forgot to tell you this, but we have been asked probably since day one, people have asked, it would be cool if we could use our commissions to pay for our membership. Well, I've got some exciting news for you and I'm going to share my screen because I want to make sure that you guys actually 
um, know how this works. This is available right now in your back office. Um, you will be able to allow yourselves or team members here. Hold on, I gotta pick up the right the right image here. I have two different images, so give me one second. Okay, um, you uh, you and yourself and or your team members, all you have to do is. Uh, click this one little section in your back office. You go log into your membership and then go to the actual resource center here. You're going to click on where it says membership first. There is a new drop then that says membership payment method. You can toggle between credit card or commission um, e-wallet. When you put commission e-wallet, the system is going to search first into your commissions to see if you have enough commissions to cover your membership. If you do not have enough commissions in the bank there, it will default to the credit card that you have on file. That is available now. And we know that that's gonna be a huge thing for some people just to keep that literally feeling like a net zero. It's like a net zero business that you're able to earn on. It just mentally makes people feel better knowing that it's not actually getting taken out of their uh, of their bank account, but it's getting taken out of their commissions. This is huge. It's available now. Log into your membership. Uh, actually, you have to be an ambassador because you have to be somebody that's earning. Log into your ambassador back office, click on membership, and then make sure that you toggle that over that the default is the commission first. And as always, you have to have an active credit card on file. If for any reason your membership goes inactive, the first, it, it tries it three times. The first time it keeps you active. If, if it and it runs it three days later. This is the default that the system does. You get an email and a text. If it happens the second time, you're you're now in unable to actually act get access to anything except updating your credit card. And um, so we we try to give you as many opportunities as you can to not ever lose access to any of the stuff. Um, yes, I think that it, it can help with the currency exchange as well because you're getting paid in US dollars. And if you actually allow your membership to pay for your, or your commission to pay for your membership, um, it just makes it even easier. So we're excited to announce that. I apologize I didn't announce it sooner. Of course, you saw it a couple of days ago, Lemon. I mean, no comment. Lemon knows more than I do about this company. She's just on it every day. Um, I want to share, I had a lot of takeaways from this event. Many, many, many takeaways. Um, I, I'll share some highlights for me. Um, that some of our husbands, Molly's husband and my husband were actually at the event and Ferris's daughter. And you know, they hear, they know it, they know the stuff, but being in the room with all of you literally changed them tremendously. Um, they changed uh, many things. Those of you that watched online um, and that were in there in person, you saw that my husband actually got choked up. And he says it was because of the stories that he, of the women that he met and the things that you poured out to him and for him to be able to see um, the big picture with what we're doing. And it's so about so much more than it's actually about. And of course, yes, my daughter, um, Savannah has been my executive assistant since about uh, March of this year. She, the, her first really experience with anything was at the Radiant Leadership and Life Coach Retreat that we did in San Diego this year to train up all of our Radiant Leadership Academy uh, trainers. And that was cool. She liked it a lot, but then had, you know, all these months to be emailing you and everything, being there in person, those of you know, she was one of the 27 women that got in the pool she got in the pool fully clothed and just was so moved by what God is doing here that she rededicated her life um, to Christ. It, it still moves me to tears. I can barely talk about it. And that's because of all of you. That's because of all of you and what God is doing here. This is about so much more. And I heard it from everybody here. I heard it from everybody at the event that you feel like maybe for the first time, you're able to be all the way yourself. And isn't that what we're on a mission to do, to help more people step into their authority and become the exact version of themselves that God created you to be? So when you're out there and you're thinking about, I don't know who to talk to, it's literally everybody because everybody needs permission to do that. And oftentimes in, an, um, in the environments that we've all been in, you have never been given permission. You've never seen people do it. You are given permission to, to, number one, become everything that you were supposed to be. You are given permission to grow. You are nudged on to growth. 
biblical growth, spiritual growth, personal growth, growth in your relationships, growth uh, to expand your thinking, to grow your financial net worth. You have people here that are multimillionaires in this company now that see the vision of what we're doing. I just have to do a little like nudge here to, um, to, to Michelle Tasco. She spoke. You're talking about somebody who has a net worth of multi-millions, who sees the vision of what we're doing here, not because she needs it, although she loves the community, but because she knows the power of what we're doing to pass this on to more people. Everybody can't do what Michelle does. It does. She has this very specific skill set and a very specific talent. Everybody can't do that. Everyone can do this. So this is a pass it on, pay it forward community where you are invited in to step into something so much more than what you ever thought possible. So I just love you guys. Um, I would say thank you to, to the team, the team as a whole. Thank you to all of the volunteers who made the event possible. And as I was unpacking everything, I loved all the volunteers even more because of the way that you packed everything up. So listen, I don't know anybody that doesn't need this. You heard from many people that say they don't like conferences. This isn't a conference. This is a movement. This is truly a movement. And the baptisms were not even something that we planned. This was something that was a, a potential, you know, wouldn't it be cool if somebody wanted to do that and we did it and look what happened. Somebody not even in our community that was watching uh, actually got baptized that night. And there were people all around the pool. I don't know if anybody noticed this. I didn't, but Bobby saw it. There were people all around the pool that didn't have anything to do with what we were doing that were videotaping what was happening, what God was doing. So whether we even knew it or not, there were lives being impacted all around that hotel. People, the staff that was videotaping during worship sessions and having been crowned as a daughter. There were so many things. I cannot even express it to you. So all I know is we need even more people to come and experience this so they can pass it on, so they can pay it forward year after year, month after month. So thank you all for just being a part of this incredible movement. I, I want to I wanna, I wanna just encourage you to go be more bold than you've ever been before because now you get it. Now you see that this is about so much more than it ever it was about. And you have no excuse to not share this with everybody. We love you so much. And uh, we will see you all when? What's our next thing? I guess Monday on the prayer call. We'll see you all Monday on the prayer call. Next week, we have our expert coaching call. Ferris is going to share some amazing things with you guys. And beginning next Thursday, right here on this Zoom, we will once again have our once a week live experience the Girl Power Alliance opportunity again. Oh, yes, I will do the Freedom Friday, Financial Freedom Friday call every Friday. That's part of just being part of this community. I love you all. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Have an amazing night. Thanks for sticking with us. Bye, everybody.